Good morning, St. Columbus, Mr. Ryan, Mr. Gawthorne, Miss Musket, and the entire St. Columbus staff and student community. Welcome. 2020 has presented new challenges for everyone across the world. And yet, as a college community, our ability to remain hopeful is inspiring. I recognize in particular the difficulty of this experience for the graduating year 12 class. And in conjunction, the strength exhibited in overcoming these unprecedented obstacles. The leadership qualities of faith in God and our joint dedication to the college has provided the means for surmounting the mightiest of obstacles. Regardless of the hardships faced this year, we remain grateful for the experiences that we all share as students here at St. Columbus. Whether it be believing that you truly are the next master chef during year, year seven food tech classes, or competing on the block during woodwork, or racing to the canteen at the beginning of lunch for one of those sweet chili wraps, we as a graduating cohort can assure you that you will look back fondly on these memories. It is true that every captain before us has said this, and we will say it again. The time really does fly by when you are having fun. We all know the prac lessons are never long enough, but our message to you is to enjoy what beautiful opportunities we have here at St. Columbus. It is an amazing school with so many people who are dedicated to ensuring that everyone enjoys and appreciates what is on offer. The spirit of this school is so strong, so believe in it. Continue to strengthen this core part of our college by dressing up on the costume days, baking a cake for the cake store, attending the sports and swimming carnivals, trying your hardest in every lesson, and always singing the school song, as these are the things that one day will be the fondest memories of your high school experience. To the staff at St. Columbus, for the love and support that has been given day in and day out, we would like to say thank you. Thank you for lending us all your wisdom and knowledge and showing us that we can achieve anything as long as we put in the miles. To Mr. Ryan, we are your first year that you have led straight from year seven to 12 at St. Columbus, and we are so grateful. You, along with Mr. Gawthorne and Miss Musket, have allowed our year to have the structure and security within the college that we needed to flourish and thrive, giving us leadership opportunities to be independent young men and women. Thank you to our numerous leaders of mission over the past six years. Your guidance and understanding as we achieved all of our milestones is the glue that holds our cohort together. Mr. Gillespie, your unfaltering persistence to push us to exceed our goals and do our absolute best is something we will forever remember you by. Miss Mulhall and Miss Pranjik, the mothers of our year, thank you for always knowing how to inspire us. Your honesty and genuinity is something held so dear by our year. You always know what to say and your ability to hold us together throughout all kinds of adversity in an, is an absolute skill and something so treasured by the graduating class of 2020. Thank you, St. Columbus, for showing us how to love education, community, and nurture our spirituality. Seeing the enthusiasm of younger years has given us the inspiration to move forward and the courage that St. Columbus is undoubtedly our home and a place that will never be forgotten. This year, we were able to install new traditions within the college that can further inspire and motivate other year groups to adopt the qualities that St. Columbus values. The house badge ceremony is a new opportunity for all students to come together to take pride in their individual and communal strengths and to be reminded of our house values of courage, mercy, hope, liberty, service and compassion. On behalf of the graduating class of 2020, 
we would like to share you one little piece of advice. You have the world at your feet. May you live every day to the fullest. Find what you love and love it dearly. Learn from any setbacks that you may experience. And finally, embrace all that St. Columbus has to offer. Thank you and God bless. Thank you.